is like, start with what you have. Let's maximize right. what you have, right. figure out how to connect what you have. And then it's going to give you insight to what you don't have and what right. you need. But right. a lot of times, you know, an owner doesn't even know like what's capable with the mm -hmm. technologies they are using. Right. So like, that's always a really great place to, to start. And that's why we say like automation and integration, because a lot of times it's just like setting up some simple automations that are in this solution already that you have. Yeah, yeah. Kind of like exactly. optimizing what you're already doing. Um, because if you're only familiar with the most basic functions, you're only getting the most basic results. Right. And so exactly. you're like, hey, this is helpful. And then, you know, a lot of what I see in helping people update their, their systems and their processes and their procedures, it's like, you know, change management is a big part of the job. Like change can be hard. Right. And so it's like, if you're already used to using this CRM or you're used to using this other tool, like we don't want to, we want to be able to work within it because you've already ad adopted it. Um, and so asking you to, you know, make a habit change is actually one of the hardest <laughs> parts I think oh, of, of what me. real estate agents and behavior changes are you, what are you talking about? We're all what? creatures of habit, right? We all like our thing, you know, we want to just kind of put it on autopilot and do our thing. And so, you know, especially when there's new tech involved, I'm sure it's really difficult.